So as we wait for the rest to join in, please free to drop in the chat how you're doing, how your week has been, with just one word. Or you can just unmute yourself and go ahead and speak up. Hi, Johans. Hi, Bekalu. How are you doing? How's it going? Yeah, you can go ahead, Johans. Okay, good morning. How are you? Good, how are you? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm good. Well, uh, time time flies, okay? I mean, uh, it's not long for me, the, 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 the sometime my months. I mean, uh, it's just flying. I don't know. Maybe we do have a lot of work to do. We just spent it. That's why. Okay. And uh, so far, things uh, seems good. Thank you. Ah, thanks, Johans. Who feels that September has been long enough or just short enough? For me, I feel that it has been long enough. You know, and I just can't wait to jump into October. Really? <laughs> okay. I feel like it's been a very long month on my end because, uh, well, I'm from Kenya and this is the month where we had our president um, verdict being um, told who the president would be and then we had the president being sworn in and it's the same month where we had the queen who passed away may her soul rest in peace and we still had Kipchoge who won so I feel like so many events have been going on in the same month and yeah that's the reason why so as the rest join in Actually, this is the last stand-up of September. Yes, also Manu and Arsenal. <laughs> this is the month where we had the football match going on. Well, I'm not so much of a fan of football, but yeah. So many things have been going on on September. It has been a very eventful month. Uh, there's no question, Johans. We're just doing a check-in. And I was just, as we begin, I was just asking who feels how their month has been so far. Was it short? Was it long? Was it, how was it for them? Was it just in between? So you can just go ahead and unmute yourself and speak if you want to share with us. Yeah, we had the best hot seats. <laughs> we we hope that Anastasia's hot seat will do like a really nice wrap up for the month. Yeah. Okay, so I think it's 
a good number. Um, Who would like to share how the how they feel the journey has been since the beginning of the training until now? Do you guys feel that you are on a roll? Do you feel that you are getting somewhere? Do you feel like you're stuck? How are you feeling this at this time? Anyone who'd like to share? Yes, your hands, you can just go ahead. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, I think I start a bit uh, in English. Let me put this uh, down there. Sorry, your hands are not so clear. Can you? Yeah, I'm going to keep it. Um, it's a bit fuzzy. Anyone who would like to share as your hands um, gets his mic in check. Anyone who would like to share how the journey has been so far? It's the last month of September. It's been quite a journey. It's a Friday. Anyone? As we continue, okay. So, if no one is volunteering, I will volunteer people. Anyone who has never spoken on our on any stand up on any. Oh, sorry for say her. I hope you get better. Wishing you a quick recovery. I would like to call upon Sorry, this is Maureen speaking. It's not Anastasia. Patrick, you can go ahead. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Uh, so thank you. So since the beginning, uh, the journey been amazing. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. So the journey have been amazing at, uh, at the beginning. Uh, it was kind of hard for me to to learn new thing today then do assign as a assignment the next day and supposed to to submit it it was a bit challenge it was not not even a bit it was a lot more challenging than i thought but i'm i'm, I'm getting better i'm getting better as we keep going on yeah it's been amazing No. Thank you, Patrick. Um, anyone else would like to share how the journey has been? Now that you're almost wrapping up. It doesn't even have to be how the journey has been. It, it could be how you're going on with your challenges. Yes, Gannett, you can go ahead. You 
Didn't we can't hear you if you're speaking? Hello. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. How about now? Do you hear me? Can you hear me? Um, your mic is a bit too low. Maybe. Okay. Your voice is a bit too low. There is any network connection problem around me? How about now? It's getting better. Okay. <clears throat> journey is good uh, and uh, even if the, we have a challenge per week we have uh, we have a new experience uh, each week uh, with a new experience this is a very uh, good and fantastic way and I like that and uh, <clears throat> uh, I have the uh, one question about non-technical assignment, if it's possible. Can I ask? Yes. Hello? Yeah. The non-technical <clears throat> assignment, which is the meter today. Hello? The one-on-one -on -one session? No, no. Hmm. Non-technical assignment. Ah, okay. The um the developing city. questions yeah mm -hmm. yeah city. is it is it is it similar to that of the last week last time we had some assignment like this is it similar to that or something different in expected from the submissions um in terms of what exactly uh, there is uh, based on the guidelines we had asked to have uh, to select certain uh, questions out of that uh, it's expect expected to select five top questions and uh, then we had we are expect to improve that and uh, is there any additional thing which is expected in to write on the document or this is enough for the submissions um what we have on the exercise is what you guys are expected to submit it's quite similar to the past but what has been changed is the scenario and yeah actually that's it so that is what is expected is okay. that good yeah yes yes thank you so much thank you Gannett. Anyone who would like to share about the week, about the challenges they've been doing? So Michael says that he's had the best month so far in regards to the training and his learning which is good i think you guys have come a long way and that is awesome um, anyone else would like to share it's friday you should all be psyched and it's the last friday of the month yes you have Hello. Hello, I'm audible now. Yes. Uh, okay, thank you. Uh, since I started the uh, training, everything is uh, going in medium. Uh, I faced a different problem in each week. Some problem uh, solved. And the other maybe jumped and even one week uh, the problem, one week problem may solve it in other week. Uh, overall, uh, I'm uh, uh, going in between, up and down. Thank you. Thank you, Johans. Thanks for sharing. Um, Margaret, you can go ahead. Uh, Margaret, you on mute if you are speaking. 
Hi, Maureen. Hi, everyone. Um, for me, um, this this week has been um a bit toughish, but I'm trying. Uh, but uh, what the last two weeks have uh taught me, I think they have pushed me out of my comfort level. Uh, I finally um, started using new tools, uh, finally started uh, using Ubuntu. It has been very scary to go there. I yesterday also started learning JavaScript for the first time. And yeah, the training is pushing me to the right side. And I love it. That's it. Okay, thank you. And do you feel um, you are on a roll? Is the learning curve coming up or is it stuck or is it going down? Um, it's, it's challenging, of course, uh, but, um, just like Johan said, some things, if you don't figure out this week, next week, you'll have a challenge that will force you to just make sure you understand it. So generally the curve is going up slowly, but surely. <laughs> Okay, that's really good to hear because it's good to know how your progress is, if, if there's any impact on what you're doing, you know, there's no point of doing something and you're not keeping tabs. So it's important to keep tabs on your skills as well. And if you're on the right track, if you're getting whatever it is that you wanted to to acquire. Um, so Kibatu says that he's grateful for being part of the Ten Academy team and he feels that he's learned a lot. Um, yeah, and Ten Academy has just impacted him widely in terms of the knowledge he's getting, as well as the skills. Um, anyone who'd like to share before we jump into the hot seat? Yes, Fongu, you could go ahead. Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Um, okay, so this week has been there's been a lot of ups and downs. Um, I think um, I've definitely learned a lot. Uh, the I think the the learning curve, as you mentioned, it's getting. Um, it's definitely increasing, uh, but I do feel uh, confident uh, this week. Um, I guess in what I have managed to learn, like there was so much stuff that <laughs> before this week I wasn't, I didn't know. Um, so I think I, I made a list of all the things. Um, I think based on my capabilities that should be done. And I mean, looking at it, it's, it's going to be difficult to complete everything. Um, but what I am very happy about is that where where I am, um, I'm able to like help myself to help myself. <laughs> if that makes sense. So uh, yeah, definitely, um, I plan on reaching out <laughs> a lot more. Um, but yeah, this, this week has been amazing. Yeah. That's awesome. Um, I like what you've just mentioned, um, helping yourself to help yourself. Well, that's the whole point. And that's a good thing. Uh, you can go ahead and teach it. Hi, good 
I'm uh, so far I think um, the whole way the whole journey has been exciting and challenging. Uh, it's just not to put challenging into it. So uh, I think uh, Ten Academy actually do what it says, uh, what it promises that <clears throat> it wants us to be job ready. So we are we are exposed to industry level tools we are exposed to challenges that can make what we what we'll be expecting as an entry level job so uh, i think that's that's worth it and so yeah it has been worth it for me okay that's awesome and how how is your learning curve adijat do you feel that is there any impact? Is it going the right um, direction that you had hoped it to go? Uh, not entirely, but I think I've managed to I've managed to adapt and to kind of chill off my head back. I do that in the morning and then to in the early early hours of the morning. Uh, I, I do the other challenge, the 10 academic challenges for the and So that has been, it's like finding a system that works. So I think this works. Yeah, I think um, it's important to, when you embark on a journey that you have decided to do, it's important for you to reflect after some time and see how things are and if it's working for you, is it where you had expected to be? And I think this is the time that you should, all of you should be doing that so that when you hop on to the next month, um, as you wrap up, you should create priorities that you should ensure that you mark all of them up by the end of the training. You know, um, at the end of the day, if you don't have um, a certain criteria where you are, you want to meet all the skills or the things that you wanted to learn. If you were just here and you're just doing things randomly, I don't feel that you'll be able to achieve all you wanted. But if you keep tabs, if you have a track, then you should be able to achieve the goals that you had set for yourself. So, um, my, what is it? It's not an assignment, but my ask for you is to look back and see how long you have, how come, how far you have come along. And if you feel that you have reached your goal, then you should give your, yourself a pat on the back. If you haven't, there's still room for improvement. You can do it this two time. And we are happy that you're here with us in Academy and do not give up. If you feel that you are on a roll, reach out to someone. That's the main reason why you have peer mentoring, peer peers. You can reach out to your tutors, you know. Um, uh, so before we jump into the hot seat, anyone who would like to share anything? Yes, Mariam. Yeah, morning everyone. I just wanted to remind um, remind us of our mock interviews for next week. So those are lots of volunteers should please signify on the channel. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you, Maria. Hmm. Okay, so who have we not heard from in a while? Okay, so <laughs> F 
Fiseha, but he's not able to speak. Fiseha, are you able to speak? Yeah, I can't speak. What is it? How are you doing? <laughs> I'm not really good right now. Uh, I'm a little under the weather, but I am trying to finish the tasks. <clears throat> My uh, blocker has been uh, held, and uh, uh, there was some uh, incident in our family, and somebody died. And I, uh, I have to change locations because there is this uh, kind of ceremony in my house, and I cannot work there. But it would have been very much easier if I was very, if I was not sick because uh, changing environments while being sick is actually uh, not that much great as you might imagine. So that is my blocker. And um, yesterday, I think I didn't make a good uh, choice. I uh, I was not familiar with uh, what was the React. I was not familiar with React, and I thought I. It would be easier for it would be kind of easy for me to migrate this week to React, and I was watching several videos. And instead of doing the whole uh, backend using uh, my, I, at least I know React uh, Flask a little bit. I should have done it using Flask, but now when things uh, get complicated, when I try to use React, I return back to Flask. So. Uh, I didn't make a good choice and I wasted a lot of time. But that being said, I think uh, everything else besides that is, you know, good. Okay. Um, well, I wish you all the best and I hope that you get better. Um, oh, uh, Mariam had mentioned that. Um, as we will be having mock interviews next week. So um, anyone who'd like to volunteer, two ladies, of course, and two gentlemen, you can go ahead. There's an announcement on the careers channel. So you can just volunteer. I think it's important that you guys go through this exercise so that you can know your strengths, your weaknesses, and you can brush off your communication skills and all that. So, volunteer and be part of the exercise. Now we will jump into the hot seat. Um, so, Emilia, you can just take over if you're here on the call with us. Okay, sure. I hope you guys are ready for Anastasia. She's your technical tutor. So make sure that you have questions for her. Good, good questions. Make sure you grill her. Make sure you get to know her, you know, because that's the whole point of this session. Anyways, happy Friday to everyone.